This tutorial will walk you through using the Search PM Work Requests view. So click this view from the supervisor bucket on your home page. And you'll see a few filter options at the top. Now the main purpose of this view is to export uh, PM work request that you've assigned to a contractor out into an Excel spreadsheet that you will be able to email them. So the best way to search is probably by vendor ID. So if you click the select value button, you'll see a whole list of vendors come up here and you can either type in the name of a vendor and hit enter to filter through the list or you can just click on whichever vendor you have assigned PM work request to and then click search now. So this will show me a list of all the PM work requests in the system that I have assigned to this vendor that are open right now. So you may need to filter further if, for example, this was a monthly PM that you're assigning to the contractor each month, you may have different months PMs in this list and you may only wish to export one month out to them. So you might want to also add a date assigned filter or PM procedure if you've assigned more than one PM procedure to this particular vendor. And you'll see all of the data on the screen. It includes your PM procedure, the work request codes, dates that these work requests are assigned, as well as any equipment information in the database relating to the equipment that is to be serviced. So if you hit the XLS button, this will generate a spreadsheet for you. And you can click the link to open up Microsoft Excel. And at this point, you can either save this file to your desktop or somewhere on your computer and then open up Outlook and email this to the contractor. Or you can use Microsoft Excel's built-in share tool to do that a little bit quicker. So click the file, share, email, send as attachment, and it will pop up uh, an email for you from Outlook with the attachment already attached to the email. So simply type in the email address of your contractor or whatever you want to say to them and hit the send button. And if you go back to Archivist, you can clear your results and search for another one if you wish. That's it. Thanks so much for watching.